Good morning, Arizona. Uh, we are thinking a little bit less about work and a little bit more about fun. So how about grabbing a picnic basket and some goodies and headed outdoors? Sunday is National Picnic Day. There you go. This morning, the pros are showing us how to pack the perfect picnic for you and the family. And Tess, why, she's having one of her own. Good morning. Good morning. That's right. It's a beautiful morning out at Encanto Park. This would be a beautiful spot for a picnic, especially when you have the perfect spread, something like from the market. We are here with Jennifer this morning, and she's Hi. giving us advice. Good Hello. Good morning. On what you should bring, what you shouldn't bring, things like that, because we know things can spoil, so that's the biggest Thank concern. You. you know what? The greatest thing is what you want to do is you want to pack smart and pack as you're using it. So if you don't have the complete spread out, if you're kind of coursing it out, uh -huh. keep everything that you're not using on ice in your picnic basket or your cooler and then bring it out when you're ready to eat it. All right. So yeah. what are the good things to bring out for you a know, picnic? I like stuff that can be pre-done. So you're just there to pop one of the champagnes or have a glass of wine or some sparkling uh, cider and enjoy yourself. Okay. So pick kind of food, stuff that you could pre-make, pack up easily and then be able to just pop into your bag when you're done. Something like a fruit salad that's already mixed up. We have a tomato watermelon salad with a little feta. Um, and then you could just drizzle a little olive oil, salt, pepper on top. Call it a day. And so. tell me about these beautiful plates. Believe oh, it or not, folks, you. these are disposable. They are. They're made out of palm, and they're biodegradable. But the nice thing is is that you could use them and then pop them in the recycling when you leave your picnic. Because this does not look like a picnic table. Oh, and that's sort of the goal is to make it pretty, it make is. it fun. Absolutely. And, you know, the great thing is is that all you need to do is just grab a nice blanket. If you're, getting, if you're doing something, you know, for two, you throw some flowers out, champagne, whatnot, and then just enjoy yourself. Enjoy the weather. Very good. Now, you are going to make we something are. here We're for us. So this is kind of a, called a stack sandwich. So what you do is that you have a uh, country roll. You want to cut around like so, and you're going to take out the middle. Okay. Now, you know what? I mean, not, not right now we want to do that, but maybe when you're leaving, you can give this to the ducks, you know, when you're done oh, with your picnic that's a good or whatnot. Idea. Yes. And then you just add, we have a little bit of pesto. It's kind of a Ooh. play on Italian. I know. A little burrata, Ooh. like so. Prosciutto. Okay, now you're making my mouth I know, water. That's it. A little heirloom tomato, which we pre slice, and then I love to make sure that it's seasoned as it goes in. So, yet again, we're going to grab our salt and pepper. And nothing is going to spill out because no, it's a sack a sandwich. Top. Yes, yes, yes. And then, starts, and then you press down like so, and then maybe a little bit more on top just so <laughs> it stays moist. Pop it in. So now you can make this the night before, wrap it, and have it pressed. Oh so then it really stays together and avoids any mess. But because we're doing it for you guys, you have a little sandwich oh, like so, and you're ready to go. Right? Okay, that almost looks so too easy. pretty to eat. A yeah. cheese board, cheese something board, like wonderful. that is simple. Yep. We do this at the market, but if you uh, want to do it at home, just hit one of your uh, local grocery stores, get a piece of wood or even a um, pizza pallet, oh, wrap perfect. it up for the visual of it. Yes, yeah, so we have some chips that we do, some fun, dirty popcorn, we like to call it. Love it. Popcorn, butter, a little <laughs> lemon zest, Parmesan cheese, just kind of like we said, pick food. All ready to go. Yeah. So National Picnic Day is Sunday. Jennifer with the market. Thank you very much. Thank if you, you. don't want to make it, just go visit her and yeah, get everything we'll get ready, ready to go. Back to you guys. Oh, that looks like yeah, fun, it doesn't sure it? Does. Well-packed picnic. Thank you, Tess.